Hi everyone, it's children's book author and illustrator Grace Lynn, and I want to wish you a happy Lunar New Year. This year, 2021, is the year of the ox. We are saying goodbye to the year of the rat, and we're saying hello to the year of the ox. Now, the ox is a very talented, very steady, very persistent and hardworking animal. So this year should be a good year for us. It should be a very stable year for us and it should be a year of good rewards as long as we work hard and consistently. So to help bring us luck in this year of the ox, I thought I would teach all of you how to draw a Year of the Ox Lunar New Year decoration. So here is your paper and find about right here on your page, kind of like lower middle right here. And right here, I want you to make a small V, kind of like that. Now from that small V, I want you to make a kind of a squashed C, a big squashed C like that. Make it really big and really wide. Now on the other side, I want you to make another big squash C. Try to make it the mirror image of the other one and connect those two C's together like that. Now from here, from one side of this shape that we made to the other side of the shape that we made, we're going to make a big upside down U. So from here, whee! Make a big upside down U. All right, now over here on the side of the shape that you made, you are going to make kind of like a, I guess I would say like a leaf shape, kind of make a leaf that's like falling like that. And then do that to the other side, another kind of leaf shape. So hopefully you can see so far, we, we are doing the ox's head and these are the ox's ears. Now we're going to make the ox's horns. Now you can see the ox's horns, they come inward like this. So we're going to make a horn that comes in like this and finishes like that. So see if you can make a horn like that right above the ear. And then do that to the other side. A horn that comes in like that and then finishes like that. So you should have two horns, two ears. All right, now give your ox two eyes. You can make them ovals like that. And then give your ox two nostrils. Make them circles like that on either side of that small V. And give your ox kind of a mouth. You could just do a kind of small straight line across like that. But to make him look a little bit happier, you know, put a little small kind of like shape like that and color it in. So he looks a little happier. Now, this is our ox, but we want this ox to bring us good luck for the Lunar New Year. So we are going to write the Chinese year for luck right here on his head. Kind of like how I did it here in this paper cut. But this paper cut has the word for spring on it. We are going to write the word luck on here. So I'm going to teach you how to write the Chinese word for luck. Now, if you take Chinese calligraphy or anything like that, this is not the proper way of how to write the Chinese word to, for luck. But uh, when you see it at the end, it, the symbol is, will seem the same. So first thing first, you're going to do a small slashing line like this. All right. From that small slashing line, I want you to make kind of a slanted seven, kind of like a Z, but missing its third line. Then from there, I want you to make a line that goes straight down like that. And then from there, I want you to make another small slashing line like that. It does not have to connect. Now give yourself a little space and go over here and make a small minus sign. Underneath that minus sign, I want you to make a small box. Underneath that small box, I want you to make a bigger box. And then I want you to put a big plus sign that goes all the way across, kind of like a window. And this is the Chinese word for luck. Fu. C. 
So here is your Lunar New Year decoration. The best thing for you to do is to take this drawing and redraw it on a piece of red paper. And then after you redraw it on a red piece of paper, hang it up on your door or your window and that will bring you luck for this year, the year of the ox. Happy Lunar New Year! Bye!